Because you guys are brand new here in Las Vegas. So actually, no. So that's a good point because there used to be a Las Vegas user group mm -hmm. that was pretty active right around the COVID, COVID times. Yep. And then apparently that group kind of dissipated, didn't, didn't revive after that yep. lockdown. You know, as many as, as that happened with so many groups and companies and we, you know, and we you work with it. a charity here called Vets in Tech, and right. they went through the same thing, very active chapter here in Las Vegas, and then when all the all the events pulled back to the national level online. Right. So we've been we've been working the last couple of years to revive the chapter. So but anyway, you so, were you were talking about you, not about me. Right. So. No, but that's that's a good point because I think that was a challenge that that a lot of us had to deal with. So when I when we moved to Vegas, being in the AWS community, mm -hmm. um, working with AWS daily, I was uh, the first thought on my mind was like, let's see what we have here in Vegas for AWS. Mm -hmm. So there was a meetup. I reached out to the right people to figure out um, if I can, you know, uh, continue that group or try to revive it if there was nobody else doing it, you know. So a few months fast forward, we're now here. Uh, last month was our kickoff meetup. Okay. It went fantastically great. Mm -hmm. Full house. Uh, we have an amazing sponsor, Visionaries NV. Uh, so if you if you want to take a few seconds to look that up, it's a great great community hub for people for startups in Vegas wanting to utilize all the resources that Nevada offers mm -hmm. to get you going, help you figure out business problems and so on. So I really really thankful to Rafael mm -hmm. uh, for providing a home for our meetup. That's great. It's uh, vision, it's called Visionaries NV. Visionaries NV. Okay. And um, our um, we're being hosted at Blackfire Innovation. Oh, very nice. Which is a beautiful place, uh, a great classroom That's for where us. my office is. Oh, I'll see you there then. Yeah. And I'll see you at the meetup too, right? I'm going to come, yeah. Yes. We're going we're gonna to get into the details as, right. lo as, long as, right. uh, as long as I am in town. I think you said it. Well, let's get into it. Let's just right. jump right to that. When's the meetup? Where's the meetup? What's happening at the meetup? We'll come back to the good stuff after okay. we get the nuts and bolts done. All right, perfect. So for our August meetup, we're meeting August 28th. I'll be here. 5 p.m. Perfect. I'm glad you know this without you taking in your calendar. Like I'm at this point where I'm like, wait a minute. Well, I, I think I know, I'm here. I know I'm leaving really the here? morning of the 29th. That's how I know. So <laughs> okay, okay, that that's a good call. Um, so yes, August 28th at Blackfire Innovation, third floor. There's only one classroom up there, Suite 400. And I know mm -hmm. that the 400 and the third floor sometimes get confused. So don't think fourth floor. Think third floor. Third floor. And we will have better signage to make sure we guide you through there's, and you come to us. There's only four floors and they won't let you get off on the second one. So you're, so, you're, you're not going to miss it. It's exactly, fine. Exactly. Um, so we, we meet at 5 p.m. We do similarly to what's going on here at Take Cali. We take a few moments to, to, you know, to mingle, to talk, to have some coffee, some sandwiches, some donuts, whatever, get our energy going. Yep. And then for this month, we're going to have HashiCorp Terraform come and do a tech presentation for, for us. <laughs> with a senior developer, Karim Satterley, who is actually an AWS community builder. So throughout the community, we support one another. I see how you did that. Right? So uh, really happy to have a fellow community builder come do a presentation. And the amazing thing is we're going to, it's for all levels. So even if you don't know anything about infrastructure as code or Terraform, come join us. We'll talk about mm -hmm. what that is. And then... Uh, Karim is going to do a nice presentation on how we can deploy safely with Terraform on AWS. So real quick, because we have a real mixed bag audience here who are somewhat right. technical, but maybe not. What's Terraform and what, what can we expect to see at the, at the demo? We, we can expect to see a good introduction mm -hmm. of what Infrastructure as Code is doing and okay. how you can deploy on AWS. So it's going to be a step-by-step, -step, very nice presentation. We're going to take questions and also... We're going to do some great swag giveaways and certification vouchers giveaways. Okay. So 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 you you can't afford not to go because they're giving away stuff. They're giving they're going to giving away vouchers for, a, for AWS certifications for, for the HashiCorp Terraform certified. Oh, for Terraform. Yes. Okay. So you can, if, if you're interested in AWS and Terraform and you're going to be in Las Vegas on the 28th, you can't afford not to be there. So Yeah. So so <laughs> let's let's get a little more basic. What what are in general what are the what are the goals of AWS community builders and then specifically what are your goals for the Las Vegas area for building our AWS community right so um, pretty much bringing awareness around AWS cloud um, at all different levels mm -hmm. so so my my goals and my hope with this group 
is first of all reviving it just recently right mm -hmm. is to keep a good pace on having those meetups regularly so people get to know us get to you know understand that we're here and we're not going anywhere yep. <laughs> so they can count on us on coming and learning every month mm -hmm. about aws and companies locally also that use aws mm -hmm. and how do they manage to solve their whatever business uh, tech problems or issues mm -hmm. with aws so it's not only about you know coming and presenting an aws service but mm -hmm. actually doing it through use cases so people can understand oh this is what my business problem was and this mm -hmm. is how i solved it with aws and other partners of course that are mm -hmm. uh, linked to aws such as terraform for example yeah. right um so um one of my goals is to approach uh companies here locally mm -hmm. that use aws provide for them um uh, an uh you know, a microphone, <laughs> a space to come and uh, talk about their solutions and how AWS helps them fix whatever problems they have or or consult other companies through that too. Yeah, there's a lot more companies that do all their stuff through AWS than than you kind of realize. It's, right. it's kind of eye opening how many how many companies have uh, started to rely on AWS to provide those kinds of services instead of trying to do it on their own anymore.